It's safe to say Halloween is the spookiest night of the year, and what better way to celebrate the holiday than to search for the paranormal? Tonight, a group of ghost hunters investigated Sir Ben's Tavern in Duluth for a spirit they say is dwelling in the basement. Photojournalist Kyle Ani has more. Little things would happen. We would hear things like shuffling, feet shuffling on the ground and the floor. Our employees had seen shadows, um, doors closing with no explanation. You can't explain these things. It's just like you know. You just, you know something's there. Uh, well, today we're at Sir Ben's. Uh, we're in the basement and we're actually here because a client who works here and owns a property has been experiencing weird things. My understanding is that uh, uh, the staff have been, uh, they've seen a full body apparition down here in the basement. I mean, people have actually seen, they've seen him, and he's usually in a plaid shirt. Uh, they've heard strange noises. But the screaming, he's heard, a, he's heard screaming before. Uh, the owner's also been, uh, uh, had the door to the uh, walk-in cooler closed behind him. The other night he was locked in a keg cooler and he turned around to go out and it was locked. So I came in, open up, open the light, and the door behind me just come like that. It doesn't lock, so somebody had to, like, I mean, literally push it. We've all seen and heard and felt something. Are we all, are we all like, you know, crazy yeah. or are we really seeing this? We investigate the claims that the, the client has experienced and we try to document them the best that we can because we want to give them a peace of mind so they know that they're not going crazy. I try to always be like rational and find an explanation of what could it be, but when a light turns off and on or a television turns off and on, there's no explanation besides what you think it might be. The Minnesota Paranormal Group will finish up their investigation this evening. Coming